love welcome back to my channel it's your girl miss Erin Vett and today I'm gonna be doing my everyday realistic skincare routine I like to start off by wrapping up my hair making sure I'm protecting my edges from any product or moisture once that's done a major key for me is these microfiber towelettes which don't keep bacteria on them like regular towels they're super soft on my skin. I actually have tons of these, so one is used for my makeup removal and one is used for my everyday skincare. I'm starting off by wetting my face and I'm using the Murag Acne Control Clarifying Cleanser. This is so bomb, you guys. I've been using this for about three weeks now and it definitely is medicated. It gets my skin so clear. It's kind of a thick, like, gel formula, as you can see. For a more affordable alternative, I've also been trying out the brand Burst with their new wash out cleanser this you can find at Target alright y'all so I took on the Murad challenge and I'm trying out a new product today but first I'm going in with the cleanser this is honestly my first time using Murad products I've heard about them for years and I am definitely impressed okay if you have been thinking about trying Murad honestly you can find these products in your nearest Sephora or actually purchase them online as well I am telling you sis try it okay my skin literally was in love instantly after the first try I do like to use a steamer here and there in my skincare routine I feel like it just helps open my pores and allow the product to really get in and clean out my skin while I clean my skin I do like to go in with a lip scrub and I've been using this one lately from actually Dollar Tree sis this is a actual dollar okay the formula is absolutely amazing it's super thick but creamy once you place a little bit of water, it actually turns into like a foam kind of, and I absolutely love that. So again, while my cleanser is on my skin and everything's damp, I do go on with my lips and just scrub that in nicely. Now, I'm not going to lie, I'm pretty heavy handed with this just because I like to really get all the dead skin off of my lips and have them super plump and look at that, voluptuous. But I do go in a second time just to make sure I got all the dead skin off. And again, you can find this at your local Dollar Tree for only a dollar. I know people have their different opinions about using paper towels on their skincare, but for me, it has never done me wrong. I prefer anything besides a rag that just collects bacteria, so I do use paper towels to lightly get the moisture off of my face before going in with this next product, which is by Murad. This is their Daily Clarifying Peel. This is the first time that I'm using a chemical exfoliant. And otherwise, I would use this one right here by Avino. It's literally my trusty OG go-to. However, we're going to be talking about this product from Murad today. So first, you want to go ahead and shake her up. This clarifying peel is an alcohol-free solution with a gentle retinoid that helps improve surface cell turnover to smooth skin without stripping it. So it basically works as a regular exfoliator. You want to apply this lightly with a little cotton pad. With salicylic acid, glycolic acid, resurfacing retinoid, and avocado extract, your skin is sure to receive its truest form. This product can be applied over your face, neck, and chest, and Murad advises the use to be for nighttime. Thanks so much for sponsoring this video, Murad. So if you're like me and you decide to use this product during the day and any other time, sis, you need to use a sunscreen. Specifically with the clarifying peel, you want to go in with the sunscreen before stepping outside into natural light and you want to apply this all over the areas that you did apply that product. If you don't use a clarifying peel, sis, you still want to go in with sunscreen, okay? Comment down below if you wear sunscreen. Now for a little lip break, I like to go in with a plumping lip gloss because usually after I do my skincare, sometimes I go in with makeup and I just like it to be all ready, you know? Next I'm going in with my favorite aloe vera, okay? I've been using aloe vera all over my body for years. I definitely feel like this keeps my skin moisturized and that's one of the things I want to mention in this video as well is that my skin is super clear, yes, but honestly it's because of what I eat, it's because of genetics, and it's also because I keep up a great routine. Even though the products that I use may change, I still use the same type of system, techniques, and I also eat certain foods that just makes my skin stay in shape. <laughs> Almost like training your muscles. I've trained my skin. Now for my favorite but most crucial part of the video is definitely going to be moisturizing. And lately I've been going in with this one by First Aid Beauty. This is the Ultra Repair Cream. It is super hydrating. I literally get instant 
hydration from this product and the best part is you can use it all over your body a little bit goes a long way as you can see the texture is honestly amazing and clearly i'm obsessed <laughs> like look at me <laughs> obsessed so i think one of the major problems i have with my skin is keeping moisture because my skin is honestly super dry um year round so that's why first i always go in with damp skin i used to literally wet my skin before using a moisturizer but aloe vera is great because it kind of primes and preps my skin to soak in the product better and the best thing about this one from first day beauty is that it has oatmeal as well as shea butter to keep your skin super smooth and moisturized for hours this product is cruelty free, vegan, has clean ingredients, it's dermatology tested, it also has no artificial fragrance which I love and it's safe for sensitive skin so it is perfect for your girl. Well guys, this is it. This completes my everyday realistic skincare routine. These are the current products that I've been using lately. I'm so excited to be sharing more skincare products with you. And shout out to Murad for sponsoring this video yet again. I will see you guys in my next one. I love you. As always, see you next time.